The Community Skills Development Foundation is a non-profit organization which promotes vocational training throughout the country. At Swakopmund, the Kostev Arts and Crafts Center opened its doors to the public for two days to display the various courses it offers. Kostev is making strides in developing the skills of the marginalized population of our country. Through that, they become, you know, or they learn a skill and through that they can, they can increase their income earning capacities and in, can improve their livelihoods. And that is what we are doing with, with all these courses, you know. We are impacting lives. We, we really change the lives of people and we give them, you know, just that I am someone in society. For years, the public has had a low perception of vocational training with misconceptions that it is only good enough for school dropouts. The students here told NBC News that they are pursuing the various courses such as leather production, welding and fashion designing, among others, because they have a passion for it and not because it is forced upon them. So leather work was the work that attracted me the most because why you can make wallets, belts, shoes, it is a multifunctional skill that you can use as a hobby as the home or as a skill to produce mass production to supply shops or want to take it further to even educate the future about it more. I love making food. Um, I used to do also, I, I used to cook also back at home and um, that is why I picked my career up and then I decided to study doing hospitality and tourism because I'm mostly interested in kitchen. I'm studying jewelry because I, for one, I love jewelry pieces and also because it's one market that doesn't really go out and I also just love doing creative stuff. Irongo Governor Neville Andre, who visited the Arts and Crafts Centre, says although some young people have no confidence in vocational training, First World Nations were developed by that industry. We are seeing that uh, you know, this uh, trainee or graduates, they also uh, come up with their own companies. So and this is exactly what I have seen today. 